Well, today marks 100 days since a Corpus Christi woman's sister has been in ICU battling coronavirus 100 days. Wow, both suffering tremendous loss after losing their brother due to the virus last year. Arena Rodriguez spoke to the sisters and bring us the details over their incredible bond and their hopes. She um, contracted a kidney infection and that's what led her into the hospital. And then from there, she um, was notified that she had COVID as well. Lorena Hernandez telling us her 34-year-old twin sister, Jessica Morales's case was so severe, she required a special device to support her failing lungs. The doctors told me that they, she needed a specialized machine, which um, is an ECMO machine, and it wasn't found in South Texas or near the coastal bend, so she was transferred to San Antonio. Jessica was on an extracorporeal membrane oxygenation machine, or ECMO, along with a ventilator. The ECMO machine actually takes the patient's blood and actually uh, uh, gives oxygen to it and removes the carbon dioxide, just like the lungs would do in the body, and then delivers oxygenated blood back to the patient's body to keep them alive. Perfusionist and ECMO coordinator at Driscoll Children's Hospital says ECMO machines are hard to come by with only three available at this facility and priority given to pediatric patients. As long as she keeps fighting, I'll show up, even if it's a two and a half hour drive one way and then two and a half hour drive back to match her effort. Lorena visiting her sister in the hospital every day to support her in her battle against COVID. Today, Jessica reaching a significant milestone. Today's actually her 100th day of reaching cumulative um, her stay in the ICU. Um, and it is a huge mo uh, milestone for, uh, for me and her as a family that she was able to survive this long. Although Jessica is still on a ventilator, she is off the ECMO and looking forward to returning back home. Thank you to all the doctors. And I can't wait to be home again. With the family. Lorena tells us she is hoping to bring her sister back home in time for her 35th birthday next month, March 12th. In Corpus Christi, Reina Rodriguez, Chris 6 News at 5.